Welcome to the Automation Studio version 8 quick start video for the PLC part 2 Allen Bradley PLC programming. Okay, I closed out of our simulation. Let's go ahead and move our output coil down to here. Just drag it and it's probably going to take the wire with it, which it did. And I'm just going to click on the wire and delete it. Oops, need to delete both sides, which is fine. And let's go ahead and add another output coil. And we're going to put it here. And we're going to rename him B3 colon 0. Good. And he's going to be an inter internal coil. Escape. Good. We're connected. Good. And let's go ahead and add in two normally closed contacts. Excuse me, normally opened. Examine. Okay, this is going to be our latching circuit. Okay, so let's escape out of it so we can get our wire. Connect. Escape connect oh, come on escape there we go I think and this guy is going to be a ceiling circuit and this one's going to come back to this rung here escape oops Alrighty, so let's name this guy. He's going to be B30. Okay. And let's reconnect this guy. And let me go check the... Okay, this coil here, or this input uh, contact, is also going to be a B30. Good. So now let's simulate it. Probably wouldn't be a bad idea if you guys are working on this to save it. Okay, let's go to simulation, normal simulation. Let's push PB1. And we have a latch. Okay, and let's see, can we unlatch it? Nope, once he's latched, he's latched. Okay, I spread out the circuit a little bit so I can squeeze everything in. So we're going to get this circuit to turn off by adding a timer. So we're going to go to timers. And we're going to get an on delay timer. And let's run the enable over here. Whoops. Escape. Click. Looks connected. And let's go ahead and let's take another B3. Let's see if I can copy that baby. Copy. Paste. over a little bit and okay now I got my on delay timer and let's go ahead and go back into Alan Bradley and let's get a oops let's get a examine if open or normally closed and let's put it in and see if he'll stick in there and he does so let's go ahead and double click him and we're going to make him a timer on and let's see if we can find a T on Oop. Oh. and 
and let's say down I think that's what we're going to use good okay let's try it let's go to simulation normal simulation and let's go ahead and push PB1 and it's latched and we have an output and hopefully when we get to time base preset 10 it resets perfect okay let's change the time for our on delay timer so double click on it Oop, first thing let's get out of our simulation we'll click on it and let's go and we're going to look for our time down data and time base let's go ahead and click on that time base technical control let's undo that and double click on it oh here it is preset sorry and let's make this a five close out of it and we have five so let's go ahead and try simulating it again okay we're latched and we're counting down and then right now we're reset after five seconds good deal